Hello again everyone. In this video tutorial we are going to solve this given equation that involves fourth root radicals and eventually we're going to check our answer for any extraneous solutions as well. So before we get started this is a fourth root obviously and this small four is called index. So here is just I give you an example that this is the fourth root of a variable a. So this small four is called an index. And one more thing pretty quick I'm going to tell you that this is the left hand side is a fourth root of an a and it is same as writing a power 1 over 4. Left hand side is in a radical form and the right hand side is an exponential form. So let's go ahead and let's get started with the solving this radical equation. So we want to get rid of this 5 because we want to isolate this radical. So I'm going to subtract 5 from both sides. So this 5 and negative 5 is gone. So we ended up with fourth root of 6x plus 9 on the left hand side and we got 3 on the right hand side. Now we want to get rid of this fourth root. In order to undo the fourth root we need to take power 4. And we're going to take the power on this side as well. So now this power 4 and fourth root they undo each other 6x plus 9 turns out to be 3 power 4 is same as you multiply 3 4 times so that's going to give you 81. And finally I want to share one more fact with you that uh, if you take the power 4 of any fourth root then this power 4 and fourth root they cancel each other out so we ended up with an a. So let's finish off this equation. So I'm going to subtract 9 from both sides. So simply this is gone. So 6x turns out to be 72. Divide both sides by 6. So x turns out to be 12 and that is our solution. And now finally we want to check our answer for any extraneous solution. That means we're going to see whether left hand side equals to right hand side. So first of all wherever you see x in this original equation replace it by 12. So, so this equation this radical fourth root radical is going to become 6 times 12 plus 9 and then plus 5. My question is, is this left hand side equals to 8? Let's see what happens. 6 times 12 is 72 plus 9, the fourth root, and then plus 5 equals to 8. So this becomes 81. 72 plus 9 is 81, fourth root plus 5 and is again equal to is it equal to 8 and this thing is the fourth root of 81 is 3 plus 5 question mark is it equal to 8 and by the way we use this fact uh, to get 3 for the fourth root of 81 you can look at it on this side so by the way this 3 plus 5 turns out to be 8 and on the right hand side is 8 as well. Is this statement true or false? Yes, this is true. Thus, x equals to 12 is indeed our solution. Thanks for watching and please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos.